And after a two-day extension, tonight is the deadline to pull boats from their slips at Folsom Lake. The drought has resulted in low water levels that we've been documenting. But as KCRA3's Mallory Hoff reports, slip runners say they got more time than some expected this season. It's been a busy day here at Brown's Ravine. About 40 of 650 boats still need to be pulled from the slips by 9 o'clock tonight. Boat owners tell me this is not their favorite day of the season. All boats must go. At Brown's Ravine, owners pulled their boats from the slips and hoisted them from the water. The Webb family made sure to take advantage of the day on Folsom Lake. It felt like we were just getting warmed up. It was our second time out, and now we have to pull the boat out. How does that feel? Um, it's kind of a letdown. We didn't even know if we would get in this year, and if we did, we were predicting maybe a May time frame. Marina operators say the water is approaching the 412 foot elevation level. When the lake gets to elevation 412, we only have six feet underneath our dock. And some of these boats draw about six feet of water, five feet of water. So out they'll go one at a time. We're depending on Mother Nature, so um, I'm just happy for what we can get. This is the, probably the you know the worst part of the season, but it's worth it. Well, today is the deadline to pull these boats from the slips. It is by no means the end of the season. We're told the boating season out here will continue until mid or late July. That will all be based on the water level, at which time a five mile per hour speed limit will be introduced. At Folsom Lake, Mallory Hoff, KCRA 3 News.